Yo guys, if you want to earn some easy free Robux, then come down to easybooks.gg. First of all, I suggest you guys to put in your username in here and log in. Don't worry guys, they will never ask for your password. And then what you want to go ahead and do is go to earn Robux guys. And in here guys, you can do easy tasks and surveys, which will give you free Robux. For example, this one right here, Roblox quiz. A lot of you guys, well, every single person watching this video right now will have have played Roblox so that is an easy quiz right there two Robux in the bank right there and then there's true or false quizzes where you can literally just say if a statement is true or false and you would get six Robux just like that that easily guys also if you want to earn more Robux guys go to promo code and use my promo code guys which is JB36 easy books press redeem that code and you will earn free robux just for using my promo code and if you have any trouble at all guys with this website or any offers you have completed then you can join their discord server and you can get assistance there and once you've racked up some robux guys and you want to withdraw it to your roblox account all you need to do is head to withdraw guys and then type in the amount of robux you want to withdraw and then press request payout so yeah head to easybooks.gg and get your free robux now guys yo what's up guys welcome back to another video so in today's video guys i'm on jailbreak and i've got another gui review for you guys and i've been loving the gui reviews on this game so i thought might as well do another one and i'm not too sure <laughs> what the name of this gui is but it looks very nice guys and i thought might as well review it and share it with you guys and give you my opinions on it and as of right now guys i think i've only reviewed three or four guis and the top two jailbreak guis are paypal and Venix GUI. And yeah, please do tell me if there is any other OP jailbreak GUIs out right out right now, like PayPal and Vinixu, and I will review it and showcase it for you guys. Apparently, Vinixu GUI also had a big update, so I need to review that one as well very soon. That will probably be the next jailbreak video. Tons of features, and yeah, I can't wait for that. But more importantly, let's get into today's video. And yeah, I'll say the shout out and everything like that later on in the video, guys, of who created it, so you guys can go ahead and show them support. So yeah, if you're brand new to the channel, make sure to subscribe with that post notification on, guys. We're trying to hit 50k subscribers by the end of the year. And feel free to like this video as well if you enjoyed it or if it helped you in any way possible. And yeah, let's jump right into the video, guys. So this is the executor I'll be using in today's video, which is Sentinel. If you guys want to purchase Sentinel, I'll put a purchase link in the description down below. It's $15 and the best executor for its price. And yeah, this is the executor I'll be using in videos from now on. So if you want to use the executor I use, then you can go ahead and do so by purchasing it link in the description guys and also the script will be in the description as well will be a paste bin link copy and paste in the executor and after that all you need to do is attach i've got auto attach turned on so i'm sorted what i need to do now is execute and there we go guys the gui has executed and on jailbreak is that the name of the gui on jailbreak all right that sounds decent so let's press customize guys and let's see what happens all right so we, i guess you can customize stuff so you can change the color of the gui and stuff like that pretty cool i'm not too bothered about stuff like that so i'm just going to press continue and it said the key bind was v so i'm going to press v all right so the key bind to enable the gui is v and let's begin with it so the creators of this gui is uga hashtag 9523 whitelist created by Aaron. So I'm not too sure if this GUI has a whitelist system. A fan just sent me this GUI, so I'm not too sure if there's a whitelist system or anything like that. But I wish they put their Discord server here so we can join and get more information, obviously. But it looks like they don't have a Discord server. But anyway, all you need to do now, guys, is go to game. And there we go. These are the first set of features. And this is like the main game features. And as you can see, first off, you can see no clip. If you turn that on, you can basically go through anywhere. So you can can get an easy easy escape right here and i'll be a criminal just easily as that and then gravity guys pretty much is oh it looks like gravity is not working what the heck yeah i can't even jump anymore oh i think it's because i have no clip on so let me turn this off and there we go now the gravity is on and that was because i had no clip on and let's try on jump guys and that will just increase your jump power as you can see right here and then there's also fly carpet guys which i don't know press f so it gives you a little notification at the bottom right corner and it says oh there we go now i've got the fly carpet oh so you press f to activate and f to disable it obviously like that 
but obviously I want it on. Yo, that looks sick. Remove all. I'm not too sure what this does. Remove all. I'm guessing that's for the buildings and stuff, but it looks like it's not working for some reason. Yeah, it looks... Yeah, nothing's removed. I don't know why that's not working. Walk speed. That's not working either for some odd reason. Maybe it's because I'm on the fly carpet. Let me go down a little. And uh, walk speed. Yeah, what the heck? It's, that's not working either. I'm pretty sure you need to be in a car to activate this. B tools. Okay, at least B tools work. All right. So B tools, pretty much you can delete anything you want to, which are unanchored, I believe. Pretty much anything you can delete. And you can also copy as well, as you can see right here. And I think this is move. Yeah, you can move stuff as well, which is pretty, pretty cool. TP to car. All right. So this TPs you to a car. Yo, that's sick. And look how fast the car is. Yo, so they automatically put like speed into your car. Oh, it's because I selected car speed earlier. Okay so that's pretty cool you know key card i believe that would just tp you to a cop or something like that and then give you a key card but looks like that's not working either for some odd reason yeah i'm spamming it. it's just not working sadly god mode i believe that would just give you god mode my hair's falling off why have i gone bold <laughs> anti-arrest i believe that would just give you anti-arrest basically you won't be able to be arrested anymore which is pretty pretty cool escape jail that will allow you to escape the jail as you can see i'm here now deploy your parachute and then you can oh what Okay, I timed that so badly. Pretty much it would launch you into the air and you just need to parachute out like I did. But obviously I failed a little bit. <laughs> so let's try out these gun ones, guys. So I think you can just press one of these and it will bring you like a box. And then if you press it, you get the guns. Oh, you can basically like spawn these boxes. And if you press it, you can equip those guns. So AK-47, shotgun and a pistol. Surely I have the pistol, right? Yes, I have the pistol. Let's go. So as you can see, I've got the pistol. I can shoot it. Everything like that flashlight i'm not too sure what this does oh it gives me the flashlight all right so as you can see now i've got the flashlight on me very very cool what the heck click to tp it says click to tp but when i press it nothing happens yo if they does have auto up that would be insane but it looks like it's not working for some odd reason but last but not least guys we're just going to go to teleports and let's try these out so jewelry store so you need to get into a car oh this reminds me of the vinixu and paypal version of their tp but pretty much it will allow you to go anywhere you want to guys and yeah that's pretty much it for the video guys I, I quite like the UI of this GUI pretty much it's very very good looking I love the fact that they put an avatar picture right there it's not a big deal but I just like the little touches in GUIs like this it's very nice I really like these little touches I'm not too sure why but sometimes it kicked me I'm not too sure why the reasons were I think it has to do with something with the whitelist system like it is stated here so I will add up the GUI creator and then I'll put in the description down down below guys so i can inform you what you guys need to do so you don't get kicked or to get the full version because i can see that some features in this gui also didn't work and i'll also put their discord server in the description down below if i find it guys so you guys can get more information but yeah that is the full review of this jailbreak gui and i don't feel right ranking this gui because i don't think this is the full version of this gui and yeah i'll see you in the next video guys make sure to subscribe if you're brand new to the channel Road to 50k subscribers by the end of the year. And yeah, that's basically it for the video, guys. Like, subscribe, and peace.